All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's me, Jay Gallus here. And I'm not even gonna lie to you, man. I'm excited about this video today because I know this is something a lot of you guys been waiting for. But before we get into it, you know we gotta take a drink together. Let me show you what I'm drinking today. See that name? In Jamaica, they call it rum cream. I'm gonna pour it, make y'all see how it looks. It's like a creamy, milky type of alcohol. It's really, really good. And for some reason, this one is very strong. It's stronger than all the other rum cream I ever tried. But I know it's not only adults that watch my videos. There's kids too. So kids, go get your cup, get your Capri Sun, get your soda. Well, I wouldn't recommend soda, but if you drink soda, get your soda, get your juice, whatever. Get some ice. Let's drink together. It could be water. I don't care what we're drinking. We're going to drink together, right? Let's do this. So we're going to be sipping on this throughout the video. Now let's get the real things into the picture. Boom. And voila. I don't have an Android phone, so I'm using an Android tablet and an iPhone. So we're going to do the iPhone first. Basically, what we're going to be doing is I'm going to show you guys how to get free movie apps on your iPhone and on your Android phone or tablet. So the first thing you have to do is go to Safari, right? And what we're going to do, we're going to download this app right here, which is called EMU. Once you start typing in, in the search bar, it should come up. So let's see, E-M-U, and once you, it comes up right here, see it? So you click on that one, it loads up, and you click on the first link. Click on the first link, and it's gonna come up like this. When it comes up like this, all you do is click this, boom. You click install, boom. When you press install, basically, this is gonna come up on your phone when it's finished downloading. Now, what I'm going to do, I'm going to download, I'm going to delete one of the apps and re-put it back on so you guys know what to do. So I'm going to delete Playbox, right? There we go. Delete. Bye. Now, you go into the app. Wait for it to load. Boom, boom, boom. At the bottom down here, it says home apps and settings you go to apps and then you're going to click on install on the apps that you want so what i downloaded was playbox i clicked install movie box i clicked install and there's this other one called bobby bobby hd and i click install so let's download back playbox click install see so it comes up install you click install again And let's go home and wait for it to download. There it goes downloading. So while you're waiting for the three apps that I just showed you to download, what you're gonna, you, got, you have to wait for it to fully download the whole all three apps before you do the next step. So let's run through this together. Dum, 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 dum. Remix. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, there it goes. All right, we're gonna hold this. We're gonna move it back into the movies folder because I like to keep my stuff organized. Boom. So just like that, after the apps is finished downloading, you're gonna go to settings. Then you scroll down, go to general. Scroll down, and you go to profile and device management. You go there. Boom, you click on this one right here, the bottom one. Click on that, and then it's gonna come up something up here where it says, um, it has, for me it says delete apps, because I already have the apps already. It's gonna say for you something else right here. You just click on it, and when that's done, basically you're gonna go back into the movie apps, and then boom, just like that, 
Never update. Remember that. Always remember, do not update it. Boom, click cancel. Now we're gonna go here, go to movies, and voila. There goes the movies. Now let's go into the next app. Play box. Same thing again. Click on don't, don't allow. You don't need no notifications. And voila, there goes the movies. Now, the good thing about this is with the iPhone, with this app, you could stream it to the Chromecast. If you don't know what a Chromecast is, go look it up. Google makes it. It basically turns your TV into a smart TV and it allows anybody with certain apps to stream or play music through the TV. So basically, let's give it a whirl. Go to Deadpool. It always have commercials or advertisement. That's how they make their money. Just look for the X, X it off, and wait for it to load. Click on a movie. And just like that, the movie's playing. Right here, you see the Chromecast button. You click on that. And if there was a Chrome, well, that's my sister's Chromecast, but if my TV was on, my Chromecast would come up right here. You touch it, it automatically goes to the, to the TV and then it says cast the TV. You click on cast the TV and then it's boom. You're watching a movie on the TV. And the good thing about it is you don't have to stay in the app. You could be out of the app doing other stuff be in your messenger, WhatsApp, whatever you're doing, and whatever you're doing on your phone will not show on the TV. So that's a plus right there. So, like I said, that's how you get movie apps on an iPhone without jailbreaking. Now let's move to Android, which is easier, not as hard, but movie folders, this is my favorite app, Movie HD. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna delete Movie HD All right, it's gonna remove it. No, I'm not trying to remove it. Let's go here, uninstall. Uninstall it, boom. Now, let's get it back together. Go to the browser, go into the search bar, and you're gonna type in movie, so you can right there, movie HD. I'm gonna click on movie HD. It loads, click on the first one, or whatever one you want to click on, but I use the first one. As long as it gets you the app, it doesn't matter. So it's loading. Okay, so what we're going to do is going to scroll down. Scroll down, down, down. And we're going to look for the link that gives you the app. So... I think I passed it. Let's go back up. Um, doom, 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 doom. Where is it? Oh, here it goes. You click on where it says download the movie HD APK here. Yep. What are you doing? Install. But is it? I don't think this is it. There's no way that's it. Click on it. It goes to right here, just like this. This is how it's supposed to look. You scroll down, and you see it says right here, Download Movie HD APK. So you click on that, and up top, you should see a loading thing. Let me clear all these notifications so you can see it. Oh, it's already downloaded already, which is super fast. Here it goes right here. I'm going to click on it. This is not even it. When you click on it, it's gonna come up like this. You go to settings, and you have to turn on unknown sources. Turn on unknown sources, you click OK. Then you click install, and now it's gonna install. Let's wait for it. Oh, there it goes. Then you click open. And boom. Just like that, the app is there. So what you can do with Android, which, are, which is what makes it different from iPhones, is with Android, when there's an update, you can click update and you can update it. With the Android one, you can do that. With the iPhones, do not update it. So... Boom, just like that, 
you can let's test it click on the movie click on videos click on the link for the video you could pick your quality always I always pick the best 1080p it's gonna load just like that and boom you going to sometime have commercials click that off and the movie started now if you have a Chromecast like I recommend you to get it's only like $35 you download this app called Allcast where you get that from is from the App Store you go to the Play Store sorry and you download this 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 app right here called Allcast so basically what that does is when you're playing the movie through here and you want to cast it to the Chromecast you click on this right here that look like a loose leaf paper you click on that you click on all cast when you click on all cast what it does is it brings up all the Chromecasts around the um like in the house on the same wi-fi and basically you click on it and boom it casts it to the tv and then boom you're watching your movie and you don't have to be in the app anymore you can do whatever you're doing and it still won't show up on the tv so that is how you get movie apps on the iPhone and the Android phone, tablet, whatever. But it's a great investment. Chromecast, thirty, thirty-five dollars. Doesn't matter if you get the first gen or the second gen. There's two versions of it. So well, it should be three now. Because I think there's a four K one. So, but it doesn't matter which one you get. The first one does the same thing. The second one does. It's just the second one has a better. It's faster. So it picks up, it, it downloads stuff faster, loads everything faster. So if you can't afford the second one, I would recommend you get that one. But if you can't afford the $35 one, just get the cheaper one. It doesn't matter. <clears throat> just the, the $35 one will work better. But that's how you get movie apps on your tablet, iPhone, whatever, etc. So you already know what it is. It's Jay Gallis. Just rate, subscribe. And today's Sunday, man. Everybody just chill, enjoy life, take a drink. All right? It's Jay Gallis. Peace.